Roman Reigns initiated the formation of the bloodline by compelling his cousin Jey Uso to join him as his chief ally. Subsequently, Jimmy, along with additions like Sami Zayn and Solo Sokoa, became integral parts of the faction. The history of the bloodline has been nothing short of extraordinary, largely attributed to Roman Reigns' dominant presence at the helm. As the tribal chief, Reigns has experienced the pinnacle of his wrestling career, delivering some of the most memorable moments as the leader of the bloodline. However, it's essential to acknowledge that there have been instances where he faced setbacks, enduring humiliation, being overshadowed, and seemingly losing control, raising concerns about the stability of the bloodline. Let's discuss the five best and worst Roman Reigns moments as the leader of the bloodline in 2023. First if we start with the five best moments followed by the worst. Let's jump right into the fifth best spot on the list. Number 5, WrestleMania 37. WrestleMania 37 saw Roman Reigns face a formidable challenge in the form of defending his Universal Championship against Edge and Daniel Bryan in an electrifying triple threat match. The encounter proved to be a defining moment in Reigns' career, showcasing some of his finest skills. In a remarkable display of dominance, Reigns secured the victory by pinning both Edge and Daniel Bryan, solidifying his position as the face of WWE. Number 4, SummerSlam 2022 SummerSlam 2022 witnessed a monumental showdown as Roman Reigns and Brock Lesnar clashed in a last-man-standing match for the undisputed Universal Championship. Regarded by many as the pinnacle of their encounters, the bout unfolded as an epic spectacle. In the midst of the chaos, the tribal chief, accompanied by the Usos, orchestrated a strategic move that concluded the match, burying the beast under a heap of objects, rendering him unable to rise. This pivotal moment marked a significant turning point for Reigns, as it not only signified the definitive vanquishing of Lesnar but also served as a catalyst for garnering increased momentum and respect as the distinguished leader of the bloodline. Number 3, Hell in a Cell 2020 Initiating his Universal Championship reign, Roman Reigns aspired to command respect from the entire WWE roster, including his own family. However, Jey Uso's reluctance to yield led to a resolution inside the ring. Their conflict reached a climax in a Hell in a Cell I Quit match, where Jey displayed unwavering resilience despite the excruciating pain. In a decisive turn, Roman resorted to underhanded tactics by applying a guillotine hold on Jimmy Uso, coercing Jay to utter the words I quit. This strategic move solidified Jay's role as the right-hand man within the family dynamics. Number 2, SummerSlam 2023 In a defiant act of rebellion, Jay Uso challenged Roman Reigns to a tribal combat, putting not only the undisputed Universal Championship at stake, but also the esteemed title of Tribal Chief. Victory for Jay meant a complete overthrow of Roman's leadership. However, Roman emerged triumphant in the showdown, and crucially, it was orchestrated with the aid of Jimmy Uso. With this victory, Roman not only silenced Jay but also successfully reinstated Jimmy into the fold, re-establishing complete control over the bloodline. Perfect. Number 1, WrestleMania 38 while the decision to have Roman Reigns as a part-time double champion may not have resonated well with some fans over time, within the realm of Kayfabi, it stands as one of Roman Reigns' crowning moments as the leader of the bloodline. The pinnacle of this storyline unfolded at WrestleMania 38, where the tribal chief triumphed over Brock Lesnar, securing the title of undisputed Universal Heavyweight Champion. This victory propelled Roman Reigns to unprecedented levels of greatness in the wrestling narrative. And that concludes the best Roman Reigns moments. Moving on to the worst one, we have five worst Roman Reigns moments in 2023. Without any further ado, let's start with the fifth worst spot on the list. Number five, could not defeat Xavier Woods. In a departure from his string of victories against wrestling legends such as Edge, Daniel Bryan, John Cena, Brock Lesnar, and Rey Mysterio, Roman Reigns faced an unexpected setback against Xavier Woods. This unforeseen turn of events occurred on the November 12th episode of Friday Night SmackDown when Reigns and Woods clashed in a singles match. Contrary to his usual dominance, the Universal Champion struggled in the bout and failed to secure a victory, ultimately leading to a disqualification that was officially recorded as a non-contest. 
This deviation from Reign's usual God Mode performance marked one of his less favorable moments in recent times. Number 4, Royal Rumble 2023 A significant turning point in Roman Reigns' tenure as the leader of the bloodline occurred at Royal Rumble 2023 when Sami Zayn unexpectedly betrayed him. Due to lingering mistrust, Reigns devised a final test for Zayn. In a display of collective brutality, the bloodline subjected Kevin Owens to punishment and destruction before Zayn's eyes. Surprisingly, Reigns then handed Zayn a chair, instructing him to deliver the final blow to Owens. However, the tables turned dramatically when Zayn, in an unexpected twist, used the chair to strike Reigns instead. While this moment resonated as epic for wrestling enthusiasts, it marked a dark chapter for Reigns. Number 3, Night of Champions 2023 Following the Usos' loss of the undisputed tag team titles, Roman Reigns took it upon himself to reclaim the gold for the bloodline. Teaming up with Solo Sokoa, Reigns faced off against Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens at Night of Champions. However, the outcome proved disastrous for Reigns, as he not only fell short of victory but, more significantly, suffered a major betrayal. In a shocking turn of events, Jimmy Uso, once a loyal ally, betrayed Reigns by delivering not one but two super kicks, inflicting a considerable humiliation on the leader of the bloodline. Number 2, I'm Out 2 Following the tumultuous events at Night of Champions 2023, when Jimmy Uso delivered a shocking super kick to Roman Reigns, Jey Uso found himself at a crossroads. In a highly anticipated and memorable segment, Jay ultimately sided with his twin brother. In a pivotal moment, Jay declared, I'm out too, just before landing a resounding super kick on Roman. Undoubtedly, this marked one of Roman Reigns' lowest moments as the leader of the bloodline. The shocking turn of events not only eroded his authority but also subjected him to humiliation at the hands of those who were once his loyal subordinates. Number 1, Money in the Bank 2023 at Money in the Bank 2023, the bloodline collided. Roman Reigns and Solo Sokoa faced off against the Usos. It was an amazing match, full of drama and brilliant storytelling. It ended with a historic moment, as Roman Reigns was pinned for the first time in more than three years. Jey Uso was the one who made history, it made sense, and it was a perfectly executed moment. This was arguably the worst Roman Reigns moment as the leader of the bloodline because he was pinned by a member of his family. Which one is your best and worst Roman Reigns moments in 2023? Share your thoughts in the comments section below. And if you are new to the channel make sure to hit that subscribe button and click on the bell icon for more interesting content like this in future. Till then see you all in the next one. Thanks!